Hi everyone, it's Stacy in Japan again, and we will continue with our Let's Read series. New Horizon 2, Let's Read 2. Try to be the only one, page 96. Why did my grandmother die? Why did everyone leave me? cried a boy of 14. I hate my father and mother. The sun was bright in the blue sky above him, but the boy could not see it because he was blind. The boy was born in 1952 in Okinawa. His father was Mexican-American and his mother was Japanese. Both of them left home when he was a baby, so his grandmother took care of him. The boy's name was Aragaki Tutomu. He liked music very much. One day, he heard some hymns on the radio. He was interested in them. He wanted to hear some other hymns, and so he went to a church. At the church, he met the minister. Tutumu told him about his life. The minister listened to him quietly. When Tutumu stopped talking, he found that the minister was crying. Oh, he understands me, Tutumu thought. The minister said, Tutumu, do you want to come and stay with us? My wife and children will welcome you. Tutumu felt happy and said yes. Tutumu started a new life as a member of the minister's warm family. Tutumu wanted to become a minister too. So he went to college and studied very hard. He also learned singing and sang in church. His hatred of his parents began to fade. He decided to help other people in need. Tutumu's Italian voice trainer once said to him, Your voice is a gift from God and also from your father. You're the only one in the world with a voice like that. Tutumu is now proud of his singing. His motto is, try to be the only one, not just number one. We can feel the brightness and sadness of Okinawa through his beautiful voice in his song, Sugarcane Fields. Thanks for listening, everyone. I hope you enjoyed this reading. Goodbye.